what is going on guys it is december 30th and tonight 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 i'm gonna get the green out of this bloody ssg so terry has helped me taken out the oven and the crystal which is now right here now it is easier to align the beam into its cavity no matter how long it takes i'm gonna get the green out of that fucking thing I guess the goal of getting out the lab by the end of December is not happening. It is now 10, nearly 10.40 p.m. and I've been here since 10 and I plan to be here all night if I have to. Wish me luck. It is now uh, 1.40 and uh, I got some green out but it is so dim that I had to turn off the light to be able to see it. It is less than 24 hours away before this chitty year is over and the next chitty year begins. Well, I can only hope that 2021 is a better year than 2020. I'm about to head home, but before I go, I think I like to talk about guilt. Guilt of not working, guilt of taking a break, guilt of not making progress, not being productive. And yeah, this came to mind because somebody uh, who lives in the same accommodation came to me after seeing my video about taking a break that she told me that she feel guilty when she takes a break. At the time, I could only tell her to take it easy, but then now that 2020 is almost over and I am not making as much progress as I wanted to, I'm starting to feel that too. I think a way to counteract that is to set up a realistic goal that you can actually achieve and not just keep on working without having the end point to look forward to. So like tonight, I set a goal for myself. I stay here as long as it would take me to reach that goal and I did somewhat. All I can do is pat myself in the back and just have to say to myself that hey, I did what I could. One thing to keep in mind is that mental health is also important. You can't just keep on working and only think about progress and your PhD. Your mental health is also something that you should be looking out for because if you're too stressed, if you're too depressed, you just can't work and your whole PhD collapses. So there is, I think PhD is a balance between progress and mental health and you just have to find that balance even if you have to work five hours a day to keep you insane. To me, I think that is a totally acceptable thing to do. Yeah, for those who are stressing out at the end of the year, not making enough progress as I am, all I can tell you is don't stress over it too much because stressing over it is just not gonna get it done. It's not helping. Also, your hair turns white according to this news article I read. Sorry for this random rant, guys. I am tired and I did not script this episode at all. I hope that makes you feel better. If you're not making enough progress, you are not the only one. So am I. My goal when I started off was to reach a thousand subs before the year is over. But even if I don't reach it, doesn't mean I'm just gonna stop making YouTube videos. For those who have already subscribed, thank you so much for hanging out with me all this time. Happy New Year to you all. Whatever you celebrate, be safe. Don't get COVID. Good night, guys. And I'll see you all next year. Ooh.